Hello everyone, it's Gil from 42 Percent Noir. I would like to share with you our third release for Easy Controller, um, and this time it supports Unity, and it's basically an easy way to control your MIDI um, in Unity, but then now in the third release, because it supports MaxMSP and Open Framework, you can use all three together at the same time. Meaning, for example, you can do your visuals in Unity, but then your audio in Max. So first thing in the package you downloaded, you just add these two scripts into your project, and then you just drag and drop them into your camera. And then that's it, basically. So just to demonstrate how it works, let's just add a cube and make it rotate. So just create a script. Let's call it Rotate Cube. And then in update, we'll just say this uh, transform dot rotate and in bracket will control each axis in a different knob. So there will be easy controller dot ask on, and then in get state, um, and then in bracket will be the index of the controller, basically the knob. So knob number one, then we'll apply it on, no on number two and number three. And that's it. Let's save it and play the only thing that it starts spinning so we might want to initiate it next time but you can see that is a controller is detecting unity the unity is running and if we play with the with our MIDI controller you can see it affects the rotation the numbers are a bit too high so we can fix that as well so to initiate Easy Controller, on start basically we just need to send um, zero to Easy Controller. So to do that, we'll just type Easy Controller dot on send dot send data, and then in bracket we'll set we'll define the index and the parameter we want to send. So we'll just send zero zeros for all three. And then, as part of the Easy Controller, we included interpolation just to make it easy. So the only thing you need to do is to add um, the minimum and maximum um, floats you would like to interpolate from. So to do that, we'll just add a comma after the index. Mm -hmm. Let's say 0 and 5 uh, will do. So first of all, you see that the cube is not spinning on start, um, so that's good. And then also you can see that the numbers uh, are better, so the the cube doesn't spin that fast. Means that even though Easy Controller sends from zero to one hundred twenty-seven, um, we interpolate those numbers into way smaller ones, so that could save quite a lot of time. So I will show you quickly how it works with Max. We have a longer video about it, but just for example, we can create Reap Ascon to activate. Um, you can see that Easy Controller is recognizing it. And then by tapping Ascon S1, we could refer to the first knob. So interpolation or scale in Max um, happens similarly to unity you just add two numbers afterwards and then you can see the beauty is that we can use different scales in different softwares at the same time so let's just create um, a sine wave quickly and just make two more so then each axis will create different sound Let's turn the audio on, and we can hear now the our new sound, those sound waves. But now we'll turn Unity on, and now it will stop.
because we initiate the easy controller with zeros and then you see you can see that we control the cube um, and create sound at the same time plus you can see that it's controller recognized uh, max and unity as active yeah so that's it thanks a lot and hope you will find it useful if you have any ideas or um, ways to make it better please let us know and yeah, that's it. So bye for now.